welcome back to another video. We're gonna be checking out Christmas Magnet, or I guess it's Magnet Champions X, and there's a Christmas update, which is good. That means they're still updating. However, they have five favorites, 500 visits, and no active players, and they wanna let me know, or they want me to let them know what's up with it. So let's hop into it. The GFX look pretty quality, I'm not gonna lie. They have a nice description with emojis, uh, which helps for some reason. We're gonna hop into the game, see if we can tell them why it's failing, maybe what they can fix, what they can change, etc. But let's get on in. All right, we got code release and code magnet. So let's just use those real quick. They have to be capitalized. All right, there we go. So that gives us 10,000 coins already. I do like this little thing floating around the magnet so we can see the amount of range that it has. Very nice. And then our upgrades. Let's see, speed, jump, coins, diamonds, storage, pets, double jump. Okay, and upgrading magnets. Uh, let's just buy all. All right, there we go. As you can see, our ring is quite a bit bigger now. And they do pull in. That's very, very nice. Now, the first thing that I notice about this is when you're going around, like, look at the pets. Uh, you can't tell how much they cost until you go up to them, which is just a big, like, not good deal, okay? Also, this is a Robux egg. Uh, I would just remove all of these squares that say not available. It just, it makes them feel like, it makes me feel like it's broken. It's not. There's just one pet in the egg. Uh, but yeah, this, I would remove all these that say not available, and I would definitely add the price on the eggs on the outside so you don't have to walk all the way up to them to see what they cost however i have 3,000 coins left so let's go ahead and buy uh we'll buy one of these looks like a pretty decent egg open animation all right i gotta say this the pet pack that you used is a free pet pack which isn't a bad thing to use free assets but this is a little bit older and sadly has been used in hundreds of games and it's been used in games that have gotten a little bit of success so a lot of times in simulators, the main thing people look forward to or collect or play for is the pets and they want something new. Even I made a game using this pet pack and the game got like 7 million visits or plays, however that works. It's just probably not a good idea to use it anymore. People want something new and unique and uh, let's see, 10k for the next door, no problem. We'll have to get that real quick. Let's open our daily chest. Oh, we got a hold E. There we go. We got 65 diamonds. I will say it feels very cramped. Like, I can't really walk around that much without running into something and i can't see that far away so personally i do feel pretty cramped within the map i also think the lighting is really dark for the type of game that it is a texture on the ground would probably benefit this quite a bit for like visual purposes not on everything just on the green maybe like a nice grass texture or something like that it would just help the uh help the map seem a little more full but not like this <laughs> right now the map is definitely full but it's very cluttered and like there's just not a lot of like i don't know there's just not a lot of space to walk anyways we have 8k we're gonna get up to 10k just to see how the door opening works if it's cool if it's rewarding if the next zone offers us anything new etc right now we're getting one to two thousand coins each time we pick up uh barely two thousand though i think we've only gotten that like once all right we've got the 10k let's go ahead and pop open this door except now we have new coins let's see uh okay it, it's stacked I get it. So we were just on a good stack, I guess. Hold on. Now I got to check something. Okay. I'm going to stand still. Let this go away. One coin. Okay. 13. We were definitely getting more for the, uh, for the new zone here. One coin here. Oh yeah. 26. That's pretty nice. Okay. So the coins do give us more. Looks like we have a new egg and that is it. Pet rock. Oh, that one's Robux. Okay. Let's see. If we go over here, this egg costs 5,000 coins in the next zone. 500 K. That's a big jump from 10 K and might be an issue. It just depends, man. I don't know how long it'll take us to get 500k. This is an 80 multiplier for 99 Robux. I do like supporting you guys, so I'll go ahead and buy this one real quick. We'll buy the pet rock. There we go. Head over to pets and throw it on. Oh, yeah. We're getting money quite a bit faster now, as you can see. I will say the coins feel like wildly more spread apart on this one, but maybe that's just because this map isn't as cluttered. We'll see. And we're already back over 10k coins, almost to 20k. How do rebirths work? One rebirth is 10k. Now, what do we lose? Lose. All right, we keep our zone, we keep our pets, we keep our magnet. I guess we don't lose anything. I was expecting to at least lose the magnet, so I'm pretty hyped that we don't lose that. Let's see if teleport is free. It's not. I'll just walk, man. I'll walk. Oh, there's a home button. Thank the Lord. We don't have enough for any of those upgrades yet, but we can buy all magnets, and that made us upgrade one. That's that's kind of tough, man. That's kind of tough. I can't lie. One super rebirth to get into the enchantment world. How do we super rebirth? Okay, 15,000 rebirths. I don't think we'll be able to do that 
one today. But just noticing what I think can be fixed, the spawn world is super cramped. Maybe spread some stuff out or think of a different layout for it. It's very unnatural. You spawn in like right here and it just, bro, where do I go? Are all of these billboards actually necessary? I don't think so. And if they are, just place them a little bit better, maybe in a straight line somewhere. I just feel like the map's very cramped together. I think the lighting is pretty dark overall for the type of game it is, and you definitely need to show the prices before walking all the way up to an egg. But other than that, I mean the game seems pretty good. The UI is a bit basic for my liking. In fact, I think it's just the vectors that I don't like, but I don't overly think that is too important in the success of a game. This is also pretty cool how you pick them up and they stack together. Some players like it when they pop up all over the screen. I personally think this is better, but 500k is a big step. I'm not even gonna lie. I feel like I've been walking around for a little while. It's not a real magnet simulator game unless you have an insanely broken game pass magnet. However, in this game, if you do have one, I couldn't really recommend buying it because, I mean, it helps at the beginning, but after that, you don't lose your magnets when you rebirth. Swaggy status? Wait, 10,000 Robux for what? Like, it doesn't tell you what it is. I would imagine it's infinite pets equipped, but it doesn't tell you what the, like, this this could just be swaggy status as in this says swaggy <laughs> like it just doesn't tell you what you get other than in the image however it doesn't seem that there is a crazy nice magnet we can buy i guess that's all right yeah that's swaggy status for 10,000 robux man if it's not actually infinite pets i'd be upset <laughs> not that i'm buying it right now but you know hey i think one thing that hurts 90 percent of games on roblox including my own is the balance of them for example we only needed 10k and our magnet size went up a good bit in the first zone. In this zone, it went up by 0.5, which to be fair, isn't noticeable while playing. And 500,000, bro, that's kind of a lot. Let's go back to the home, see if we can upgrade our magnet like a good bit. Oh yeah, there we go. That's a, that's a good bit. Now we have a wider range and that'll help us sort of uh, make some money faster. I think the game has potential. I would just work on the things I've mentioned. And as always, if you're the owner of the games that I'm playing, check out the comments because a lot of the fans leave their like uh their feedback and what you could do to make the game better so i would definitely check out the comments i should also get more pets that would probably help me uh a lot 5k you hatched a spider all right wait this oh that's an uncommon okay i was about to say like that's not that much better man but it's all good i think i think we've pretty much said everything that needs to be said about this game i would definitely change up the lighting and the other quality of life uh changes that i've said can we get coins in the other zone but guys, I do think that's going to wrap up today's video. If you did enjoy and you want to see more content like this, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a great day. Later.